Now to Washington State, where the police command says it will not condone any act of violence as the general election approaches. This follows attacks by some suspected political thugs in Elisha. Rafiul Hamid reports. In the last few weeks, there has been rising political violence in the state. Billboards of various political parties are not speared in different parts of the state, including Oshobo, Ijebujesha, Elisha, Ede, Ikiron, among others. On the 24th of December last year, a former commissioner for works and transport, Remy Omowaye, was attacked and his vehicle destroyed. Here is another attack on the Tinubu Shatima campaign office in Elisha on Saturday 7th of January. Same day, the chief of staff to the speaker of the state assembly was also attacked and sustained injuries. Members of the APC alleged that all the attacks were carried out by the PDP. Got here this morning, we saw that this entire place had been ridden with uh, bullets. This is happening second time within two weeks. Um, it is so shocking that this is happening. We have reported severally to security agencies. Nothing had been done. Peace has come back to Ijeshala. For the past three weeks now, the Ijeshala area, the six local government in Ijeshala, they have stuck to battlefield. Go to Igangan today, if Iwara. Nearly all the people have deserted the area. But the People's Democratic Party debunked the allegation. Well, the party in government, and um, we are busy trying to put um, a government in place and put smiles on the face of uh, Oshun people. I don't see any reason why we should engage in attacking an ex-commissioner. While the All Progressives Congress says no member of the opposition parties was attacked while the party was in power for 12 years in the state, the People's Democratic Party says the attacks could have happened as a result of internal wranglings within the APC. The state police public relations officer warned that the command will not condone any act of violence. Anybody that is found, you know, doing what is not right, we, we are assuring them, the police is assuring them that they are going to face the full rot of the law if they are caught. And there is no way they will run away. They cannot run for long. She assures law-abiding residents of the state of adequate security. It's about 45 days to the election, and it is expected that security operatives will stem the tide of the attacks to guide against voter party on the election day. Rafi Hamid, TVC News, Ushibu.